bookies, it's Meg. Today on The Book Cookie, I'm featuring a book from Danielle Page that will have you clicking your heels in fright. I can't wait to show you the cookie recipe I paired with this sweet read to bake with your friends, your family, or host at your own book club. It'll make you feel there's no place like home. In Dorothy Must Die, main character Amy Gum comes to the rescue in this quirky take on the classic version Wizard of Oz. The creepy twist comes mid-plot when Amy is chosen to represent a rebellion against the ruler of Oz, who is actually Dorothy, not the Wicked Witch of the West. The struggle is real for Amy in her day-to-day -day high school life. She never dreamed she would be teaming with a band of flying monkeys and prepping for battle, hashtag so brave, against the entourage of Scarecrow, Tin Man, and Vicious Lion we all thought was once so cute and cuddly. Dorothy is evil, and someone has to lead the revolutionary order of the wicked. Can she do it? Will she do it? This book is published by HarperCollins and can be ordered through Amazon at thebookcookie.com. Dorothy would just die for these ruby red velvet frosted cookies, thanks to Tracy at tracysculinaryadventures.com. Why this particular recipe? These cookies have a light and fluffy tang used with sour cream instead of buttermilk. And of course, an easy beyond easy cream cheese frosting, which we all know is a must with anything red velvet, as Tracy explains on her step-by-step -step recipe. Thanks for stopping by the book cookie. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and visit me on Instagram. I'm Meg. Come back next week for another October-themed book and cookie pairing.